Roulette, the French word for little wheel, has a very simple premise. Spin a wheel, hold your breath. It's a really exciting game in which you may find yourself screaming and embracing a total stranger. If everyone's cool with that, of course. Just looking at a roulette table may intimidate you, but by the end of this video, we promise you'll feel differently. You'll start by giving the dealer your cash or ticket in exchange for chips. In roulette, every player has a different colored chip to keep all the bets out on the table straight. Just tell the dealer how much you want each chip to be worth. A dollar, five dollars, or twenty-five dollars. Before playing, you'll set out your ante here. An ante is basically a fee to play each round required by the state of Oklahoma. At this particular table, the ante is a dollar. The only thing to really learn about roulette is the different ways to bet. The spin itself is totally straightforward. It's a ball, it's gonna land on a number, and that number is either red or black, or very rarely green. That's it. So, let's break down the betting for you. Here's the roulette table. We'll start with what are called the outside bets, the ones outside of the main grid of numbers. You can bet on odd numbers or even numbers. You can bet on red or black. You can bet on the low numbers from 1 to 18, and you can bet on the high numbers from 19 to 36. Each of these bets has about a 50-50 chance of winning and pays one to one, meaning you can double your money. Next, we have six 12-number bets. You can bet on the first, second, or third dozen numbers or you can bet in columns like this. These pay two to one, meaning you can triple your money. If the minimum bet at the table is $5, which you can find on a sign at the table, that means each outside bet you make must be at least $5. Now we'll move to the bets that take place on the inside grid of the table called the inside bets. For these, your $5 minimum can be spread around as long as you have at least $5 in total bets on the inside section, you're good. This is a good time to tell you that if at any point you get confused, make a mistake, or just have questions, Adam is here to help you. That's literally why he's here, so that everyone has a good time. Okay, so back to the inside bets. There are many ways to slice and dice it, but it's all pretty intuitive based on where you place your chips. You can bet on a single number. You can split your bet between two numbers. You can place a corner bet, which is four numbers. You can buy what's called a street if you place your chips here, or even a double street. All these placements have different payouts based on their odds, and you're always welcome to ask the dealer for those details. At the end of the day, though, you really can't make a mistake in what you bet on. It's all just personal preference. A heart. That's a valid but highly unorthodox strategy. Black 20. The dealer marks the winning number, clears the losing chips away, and pays the lucky winners. The dealer will take care of all the math, so you don't need to do anything. And that's the game. When you're ready to leave the table, trade your roulette chips back into regular chips, and you're on your way. We'll see you at the tables.